Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Chris, this is Dirty Trucker 08, and you're watching this video because your headlights are kinda dingy looking. a Little bit hazy, a little bit crappy, kinda hard to see in the dark. And you wanna know the most important step in getting those headlights back to looking new. By the end of this video, you'll know how simple it is and how to follow a few basic rules to get those headlights looking back to new. Let's get started. So basically, I've got a friend who was wanting to know a little bit about getting his headlights taken care of without spending a whole lot of money. So I got on Amazon, ordered a very inexpensive kit. The kit I purchased is actually a 3M brand. And if you've been working on your car very much at all or pretty much anything around the house, you know that if it's got 3M on it, it's typically pretty good. So what I got is the 3M headlight restoration system. It does attach to a power drill. It's got different levels of pads within it, along with step-by-step -step directions. So what we're gonna do today is get a pair of headlights on a car that I've got that are looking kind of crappy, see if we can't make them look better. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is go ahead and clean the headlight. If it's not clean, all you're doing is scrubbing around dust. So once you've got it clean, you'll wanna go ahead and open your headlight restoration system and watch it fall off the hood. All right, now in this kit, it's got 500 grit, 800 grit, and then a polishing compound. So we are gonna start with the 500 grit. Take one of the 500 grit discs and our pad thing. Oh, it has a 3000 also. Now you don't just take the drill and put it on. You've gotta have it at least a little bit wet whenever you're working on it. So I brought out a water bottle. <sighs> yep, that's good water. Put a little bit of water on there. We're gonna start on that far side. You can see it's already starting to get a little bit milky. Go ahead and switch up to the 800 now. Doesn't take a whole lot. A little bit goes a long way. I think that'll be good enough for the 800. Go ahead and put our 3000 pad on. As you can see, it's already starting to look a whole lot better. Now we're going to go ahead and give it another quick clean before we start to do the polish. A little polishing pad put on. For the directions, it said just to use a little bit in the center. Doesn't take much. So we put just a little dab in the middle and we're going to go slow. We don't want to just be cleaning it out until we kind of get it spread on there. There we go. Remember to keep light even pressure whenever you're applying it. And we'll give it one more quick clean. And as you can see here, I didn't touch this side at all. You can see how hazy it is and how crystal clear this other side was. Just a few easy simple steps. 500 grit, 800 grit, 3000 grit, and then the polish light even pressure on the drill as you're going through it not a whole lot to it but i mean look at these results you've got your your crappy before side and your way better looking after side after literally just a few minutes the counter on my video says i've been going for about 15 minutes so if you take about 15 minutes per headlight a half hour worth of your time and your headlights are looking way better you'll be able to see a whole lot better at night that looks a whole lot better now those of you that have looked into this before know that i skipped a step this is just a parts car that had some crappy headlights on it that I was working on here for you. But when you're working on your car, the most important thing you can do whenever working on your headlights like this is to take painter's tape, preferably double it up one layer and then another layer on top of that and go around the edge of the headlight. Everything you're sanding on, on the lens itself, if you don't tape and protect that paint, you're sanding on your paint too. So the most important step, which I didn't even do myself because like I said, this is just a parts car, is to make sure and tape that paint. 
protect your edges so you don't sand through the rest of your good looking car. And if you wanna keep those headlights looking good like they do now, go ahead and throw your favorite wax on there. Give it a little bit of a polish with that. Or if you wanna go all out, get yourself some PPF or a little bit of clear vinyl, a little bit of tint perhaps to put on there. That'll absorb the sun's rays so your headlights stay cleaner longer. But hopefully this was helpful. Hopefully you guys learned something. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so everybody else can learn that they can save themselves some money when working on your headlights. And if you like what you see, take a look around. You might want to go ahead and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.